first some comparative language. So basic comparative language, beginner's comparative language. This is a beginner's lesson today. So I like mm more than mm. So you can say I like Messi more than Ronaldo, maybe. Or I prefer, I prefer Messi. And here we use two. The preposition is two. I prefer Messi to Ronaldo. And if you want to say somebody is good, but somebody is more good, in English we don't say more good, it is irregular and we say better. So you can say Messi is better than Ronaldo. Or maybe you think maybe there is more than two people and you want to say they are the best because this is the superlative of good, so it's Messi is the best. Okay, now my team. So my formation is 4-3-3. Three, three. So goalkeeper between the sticks, two players, Peter Schmeichel or Gianluigi Buffon. For me, Peter Schmeichel was very good. He was amazing in the Premier League. So in my team, I prefer Peter Schmeichel to Gianluigi Buffon. Crossing again and a good one. And not it down, a wonderful save by Schmeichel. At right back, there are two Brazilian choices, Dani Alves or Cafu. And for me, I think Dani Alves is better than Cafu. He is more attacking and he is playing now. I think he is 36 years old and he is amazing for Brazil. I think he plays for Sao Paulo now, but he, he is still playing for the national team and he is playing really well. So for me, Dani Alves. At left back, there are two choices, Paolo Maldini and Roberto Carlos. Again, this is a difficult decision, but for me, just because of his defending and his career, I think Paolo Maldini is better than Roberto Carlos. So those two positions, left back and right back, you can call them full backs. Okay, now in the center of defense, so the center backs or the central defenders, the two options here are Baresi and Nesta. So for me, Baresi was amazing. So for me, Baresi is the best in my life probably. So they, I like Baresi more than Nesta. Il 27 agosto 1995, Baresi sigla il suo ultimo gol nel campionato italiano. L'assist è di Giorgio Weah al suo esordio. The other centre back may be controversial, but the two choices are Virgil van Dijk or Koulibaly from Napoli. I'm going to give another one, Thiago Silva from PSG. But for me, I think Virgil van Dijk is the best at the moment, so he is in my team. Okay, in midfield now, in the engine room, and the two options are Roy Keane and Frank Rijkaard. And for me, I think Frank Rijkaard is better than Roy Keane. I love Roy Keane. I had posters of him on my wall when he was a Nottingham Forest player, but for me, Frank Rijkaard is better than Roy Keane. Also in midfield, on the left side of midfield, the two options are Maradona or Zidane, which is a difficult decision. I love Zidane, but Maradona is better than Zidane. Minutes later, Maradona scored what is widely regarded as the greatest FIFA World Cup goal ever. He glided past several English players before rounding goalkeeper Peter Shilton and scoring. It was quite simply the product of pure genius. OK, on the right side of midfield now, another midfielder, an attacking midfielder. The two choices are Lothar Mateus and Steven Gerrard. And I love Steven Gerrard. I watched him a lot in my life. But I think Lothar Mateus is better than Steven Gerrard. 
he could play anywhere. He was a defender, a midfielder, an attacking midfielder. He was a phenomenal player. So for me, Lothar Matthäus is in my team. It was the German captain who made his mark. He opened the scoring with a fine shot on the turn before Jürgen Klinsmann doubled the side's advantage before half-time. Davor Jozic pulled the goal back for Yugoslavia, but in the 64th minute, Matthäus pulled off an amazing strike to put the game beyond doubt. Okay, in attack now and on the left side of the front three, we say in English, so this is the midfield three and this is the front three. So on the left side of the front three, there are two choices, Ronaldo, Cristiano Ronaldo or Thierry Henry. So two amazing players, but for me, I think Cristiano Ronaldo is a little bit better than Thierry Henry. And then Ronaldo! Oh! Okay, the number nine, the striker, the two choices are Ronaldo, the phenomenal Ronaldo, the original Ronaldo, the Brazilian Ronaldo, or Luis Suarez. So Luis Suarez played for Liverpool and Barcelona. He was amazing at Liverpool. One of the best players I have seen play for Liverpool. But for me, I think Ronaldo is better than Suarez. Oh. <laughs> Okay, so the last position, and you probably know who it is going to be. On the right side of the front three, it, the choice is Messi or Rooney. So I really like Rooney, he was a phenomenal player, but Messi is probably the best. So Messi, I prefer Messi to Rooney. Along with Barcelona and Real Madrid, Athletic Bilbao have never been relegated yeah. from the Primera Division. It's something to be admired, I have to say. Well, it's real and Ronnie still going. Look at this, Kevin. It's a brilliant run from Messi. Did he go all the way? So that is my team, the In My Life 11. In goal, between the sticks, is Peter Schmeichel. At right back is Danny Alves. At left back is Paolo Maldini. The two centre backs are Virgil van Dijk and Franco Baresi. In midfield is Frank Reichardt and then on the left side we have Maradona, on the right side we have Lothar Matthäus and then up front in the front three on the left side I have Cristiano Ronaldo as the main striker Ronaldo and on the right side Messi. I think it's a good team. Why don't you try your own? Maybe you disagree with the choice that I made in this video Please like and subscribe to my channel. I also have a Facebook group where I discuss things like this. See you in the next video.